A reading from the prophet Jeremiah. The Lord says this, A curse on the man who puts his trust in man, who relies on things of flesh, whose heart turns from the Lord. He is like dry scrub in the wastelands. If good comes, he has no eyes for it. He settles in the parched places of the wilderness, a salt land, uninhabited. A blessing on the man who puts his trust in the Lord, with the Lord for his hope. He is like a tree by the waterside that thrusts its roots to the stream. When the heat comes, it feels no alarm. Its foliage stays green. It has no worries in a year of drought and never ceases to bear fruit. The heart is more devious than any other thing. Perverse, too, who can pierce its secrets? I, the Lord, search to the heart. I probe the loins to give each man what his conduct and his actions deserve. The Word of the Lord A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke Jesus said to the Pharisees, There was a rich man who used to dress in purple and fine linen and feast magnificently every day. And at his gate there lay a poor man called Lazarus, covered with sores, who longed to fill himself with the scraps that fell from the rich man's table. Dogs even came and licked his sores. Now the poor man died and was carried away by the angels to the bosom of Abraham. The rich man also died and was buried. In his torment in Hades he looked up and saw Abraham a long way off with Lazarus in his bosom. So he cried out, Father Abraham, pity me, and send Lazarus to dip the tip of his finger in water and cool my tongue, for I am in agony in these flames. My son, Abraham replied, remember that during your life good things came your way, just as bad things came the way of Lazarus. Now he is being comforted here while you are in agony, but that is not all. Between us and you a great gulf has been fixed, to stop anyone if he wanted to, crossing from our side to yours, and to stop any crossing from your side to ours. The rich man replied, Father, I beg you then to send Lazarus to my father's house, since I have five brothers, to give them warning so that they do not come to this place of torment too. They have Moses and the prophets, said Abraham. Let them listen to them. Ah, oh, no, Father Abraham, said the rich man, but if someone comes to them from the dead, they will repent. Then Abraham said to him, If they will not listen either to Moses or to the prophets, they will not be convinced even if someone should rise from the dead. The Gospel of the Lord